and I just had to have it finally. And my dog just joined me. Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm super excited to share my Christmas present with you. I bought some fiber and some yarn so that I could do an unboxing video for you. First question I have for you though, do you think I look better with or without makeup? My husband thinks that I shouldn't be wearing makeup. I think it looks better in my videos at the very least. Um, so I just wanted your opinion on that. Today we are going to be unboxing wool from Wild Wool Farms and Car Park Artisans and Weird Sisters. And since I'm a little weird myself, I couldn't help it. I've been eyeing this for maybe two months now and I just had to have it finally. And my dog just joined me. Leah likes to do unboxing videos with me because then she gets to check everything and make sure that it's actually real wool. So the first one will be from uh, Car Park Artisans and the fiber in here um, will help uh, me with uh, finishing off uh, the wall hanging that I started. Um, this is the wall hanging that I've been working on um, to tell a story about learning to be resilient with hydrocephalus um, and ultimately learning to live with it. So the fiber in here will help with the last section of that. So this is some um, bright, uh, bright colored sari silk and similar to the blue that I got from Chameleon Fiber Co. Oh, she looks in a little sample. That's very nice of her. This is the fiber that, that I ordered. It is sari silk and as you can see, See, it's very pretty. And again, this is from Car Park Artisans. Now, this is from Weird Sisters Wool Emporium. And like I said, I have been eyeing this item for at least two months. And finally, I decided I just had to have it because it was so, so me. The colors were just so me. <laughs> and um, I often don't make things for myself, but this one just screamed out at me, had to have it. And uh, so, And it did not disappoint. <laughs> Ooh, there's something else in here. Oh, it's a handwritten note. Oh, nice. So, this is... So the, uh, this colorway is called Quibbler. And as you can, you can probably see now why I absolutely had to have it because it has all of my colors in it. And it also has some Stellina in it. Um, I, I picked this, uh, base this fiber base because it had Stellina in it. I don't know if you can tell, but the Stellina gives it a nice little sparkle. 
And this is the problem with not having a working ring light. You'd be able to see it better. I'm excited. I'm gonna have some fun with this. And then finally, we have a package from Wild Bull Farms. And the reason why I'm not putting the uh, label facing you guys is because I did an unboxing video and then I had to delete it because it showed my address and full name. I didn't want to put my address and full name out on the internet. <laughs> So I have ordered from them once before. And this is um, a, uh, this is a sampler box um, that has 10 ounces of roving, or that has 10 ounces of Rolex in it. Um, and I don't know what the Rolex are going to look, yeah, look like, um, because it's a sample box, obviously. But I've seen some beautiful Rolex from them in the past, and, um, last time I got some Rolex that were white and blue and pink. So again, I don't know what this is, but we are going to find out together. Let's see, it says behind every spinner is a flock of naked sheep. Hey, they got our, they got our back. <laughs> So, they also sent uh, tea and a chocolate. And this is a blend of Merino, Bambino, Corydell, or sorry, Merino, Bamboo, Corydell, and Firestar. That should be exciting. Look at those. Aren't they pretty? Yeah, those are be fun to span up. Yeah, this will be a lot of fun. And It is a little darker than what I normally go with, but like I said, and this is a sample box. Um, so I never know what I'm gonna get. And I think it's going to um, end up being really pretty. Um, and I am trying to think what in my sash I could, um, I could spin it with that could make these uh, colors pop out um, and I know I have something in my stash uh, to spin with it. Okay so one of the problems with having my craft room in the basement and the lighting down there is that it looks like a cave. So I brought this box of Rolex up to oh, a brighter light and it, the Rolex are actually much brighter than they looked when we were downstairs. So I just wanted to show you uh, what they look like in a brighter light. So thank you very much, Wild Wolf Farms. And I'm really excited to spin this up. Uh, it should be a lot of fun. 
So I hope you enjoy this unboxing video. I hope you're and I hope you're gonna have a great holiday season. And let me know in the comments below if you want to see more unboxing videos like that or updates on my uh, wall hanging or anything like that. Um, take care. Bye.